patam 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 in Blender 2.83, you have two different workflows to work with colors in Grease Pencil. One of them is Material, is the classic one, and the new one is Vector Color. And it's important to know how it works. With Vector Color, it's more easy to create uh, a colorful palette, okay? Or, for example, here, in this sample, the background is made with Vector Color and some um, noise modifier. Stop. Okay, so how is work? When you start to draw, by default, you are working with material. So I start to draw this, and you, I, and I have this base material, and I can change the color here and change for the all animation. Okay, but if I go here and press vertex color, I now I start to draw on top of this material this color. Okay, it's the same thing uh, when you are working, for example, with geometry, you have this base color and if you go to vertex pane, okay, and now you start to draw this vertex color, this vertex color are draw on top of your current material. This is important thing to know. So, for example, you can combine this both, uh, this both workflow, for example, here, this character, uh, okay, this character is working with material, so you need to create a lot of colors, a lot of materials, okay, this is the downside of the material workflow, okay, but the good thing here is that you can change the color for the whole animation, okay. And um, for example, the the background. If I select the background, I only have a few base material, and you start to draw using vertex color on top. Okay. One, two, three.